Welcome trainers to the region of Paldea, populated by people and Pokemon alike, and home to Naraja Academy, one of the largest Pokemon schools in the world. Our story follows Neva and their partner Fairybrand, who have just moved from Alola, and is excited for their journey to continue. Calling Neva to the director's office, please. Once again, never to the director's office, please. Oh ma, it's the first day. How could I possibly be in trouble? I don't understand. Excuse me, Director Clavel? Thank you for coming, never. Have you been enjoying your time here, the Naraja Academy? Well, y yes sir, I've been having a lovely time. That is most wonderful to hear. Now, you may be wondering why you would not have conversed earlier in the cafeteria, but let me assure you there is a reason why I asked you to meet me here. It seems that a friend of mine has a rather serious matter they would like to discuss with you. With me? But, director, no one is here. Oh, uh, no. I'm afraid they aren't actually here in the room with us. One moment, please. Just allow me to, uh, to connect us. Hello, Never. It is nice to meet you. My name is Professor Sada. I carry out Pokemon research within the great crater of Paldea. At a site known as Area Zero. Oh my, you mean the crater in the middle of the region? The professor is in fact a graduate of our fine academy, as well as a splendid researcher. Well, allow me to get straight to the point. Never, student ID number 805C393. You are the student who travels with the unusual Pokemon, Koraidon, is that correct? Uh, yes ma'am. Uh, I don't know how you know that. Thank you. I appreciate that you were honest in confirming the facts. Uh, not that I... I do not mean to offend you. In fact, I wish to ask for your assistance. Uh, assistance, ma'am? Uh, with what, exactly? Cran. Oh, how good to see that you are well. It has been quite a while since we last met. Professor, you know this creature? Coridon was once in my care, you see. Its Pokeball was also originally mine. I assume you received it from a young man called Arvin. I am no longer in any position to be able to manage that Pokemon myself. This is what I would ask of you. Will you continue looking after Coridon on my behalf? Oh, uh, yes, Professor, I'm more than happy to. I've, I think we've made a, quite a good bond. I do appreciate your agreement. Horizon has been greatly weakened and is currently incapable of battle. It can, however, take on a form specialized for mobility. In all likelihood, it will require some time to fully regain the capabilities it once had. I will provide you with my contact information. If you would please get out your phone. Uh, no problem, Professor. I will be in regular contact going forward to keep tabs on your status. Oh, uh, yes, ma'am. Until then. Could this Pokemon have its origins within Area Zero? I couldn't tell you, Director. 
Sato, don't tell me you actually did it. Well, it seems that the professor is asking quite the favor of you. But of course, the Academy is always here to support you in any way that we are able. I do hope you'll continue to enjoy your school life together with that Corridon. No. Th thank you, Director. I get, I'll see myself out then. Hello, excuse me. Oh, you're still here, Never. Getting called to the director's office? How did you land in that much trouble already? I'm kidding. I know it wasn't like that. Mr. Jacques wanted me to show you the way to your room in the school dorms. Your very own private room, Never. Let's go check it out. Ta-da-da-chan! From today on, this is your new room, never? Actually, it's as new to me as it is to you. I've never been in here before. Maybe check out your new bed. It looks comfy. And you must be pretty worn out from all this. A quick rest on a bed is all you need to get yourself and your Pokemon healthy again. I'll see you tomorrow when you've rested up. Then, we can battle even more. Take care! <laughs> Thank you, Nimona. Uh, I hope you have a pleasant evening. This is quite a sizable room. But I suppose I should get comfortable. <laughs>